it is Monday. Zoe's on her second to the last Zoom of the day, putting lipstick on in front of the camera and drawing. They're on mute, but Miss Aguilar, their teacher, is or her teacher is reading the story. Hey guys, so it is Monday. I am going to tackle the girls' room. It's not that big of a mess. Um, we had the twins this weekend, so I really didn't vlog much over the weekend, um, just because, you know, there's really nothing that we did exciting. All right, so this is what I need to um, hang and put in their drawers, and then that is everything. They got a bath after their, after Zoe's second, third Zoom today. She wanted to have a bubble bath, so that's what they did, and they just left everything on the floor have to make their bed and that's about it. We have to feed the fish. They still have to feed their fish. So as you can see, there's a lot more room in here. Remember I had toys all the way up to here like stacked up. They have with that pink bucket and that red bucket right there. And then they have some toys back there and another pink bucket. And I mean, I decluttered a lot of toys, you guys, and they still have a lot. So it's not like they're going without. Also, I forgot to mention, I think you saw me cooking on one of these um, new pans. I ended up ordering new pots and pans. Finally, you guys, I saw these and fell in love with them because they're rose gold. And it was um, this pot that pan, this pan. So it comes with a huge pot with cover and then a smaller one. And I love the fact that the inside is like speckled or what do you call it? Like a, I don't know, I just love it. You can't really tell, but it's like pink and everything and everything just slides right off the pan. I am in love and the reason why I picked this color is because you guys know I'm looking for a house and I want an all white kitchen. And I figured that these would just add a little bit of color instead of getting like white pots and pans. So I really love these so much. Hey guys, so it is now Wednesday. I think I vlogged a little bit on Sunday and Monday. Yesterday I didn't vlog anything. So I didn't have enough uh, footage to put up a vlog for yesterday so I'm including this um hubby had gone last weekend when we went to go look at houses we stopped at Target because um they have like a whole bunch of huge sales on toys and so he ran into Target and he came out with like two bag fulls of all of these toys but the girls have already opened some but I wanted to share with you guys that these were like I don't know up to like 75% off they've opened about two of these each they have one left and it's just like a awesome blossom so you put this little um sparkle stuff in it and then you add water and then it blooms and a little figurine comes up <laughs> so they really enjoy doing that so usually i'll let them open one if zoe's doing really good in zoom you guys know the struggle's real with her sometimes she's got good days sometimes she has bad days i also did go get my nails done yesterday I went with just white and I cut them down because they were getting too long and you guys know I had a broken thumb and then this one had broken just you know I'm rough with my hands because I'm always doing something around the house but anyway I thought I'd share this with you guys and then yesterday um, hubby went where did he go he went to Target. He, you guys already know he loves Target and he's on this Pokemon kick. He buys Pokemon like almost every day. <laughs> but look how cute these are. He found these shirts for the girls and I think I'm going to put them in their um, basket or bag, whatever I make for them for Valentine's Day. But it says my mom is my hero. How cute is that? These are Cat and Jack and they were $4.50. So of course... We get them the same thing and then how cute is this so cute i'm almost thinking that zoe needs to go to up a size um but they probably didn't have a six i don't know i think she's already starting to go up into like the little girls section and not like the um you know what i mean like not the like toddler kids section you know what i mean Anyway, so 
5T is definitely good for Zia because she's petite. And then Zoe, I believe she's starting to grow out. She will be six in March. So I'm thinking that this is not really going to last that long on her. She's really long-legged. So is Zia. Uh, Zia's body, though, type is like more petite. So the clothes fit her longer than they do Zoe. So anyway, I thought I'd share that and include that into the vlog. I would show you hubby's collection, but I'm not even about to scare you guys <laughs> with, with um with his uh collection of Pokemon cards. Oh, I also wanted to share with you guys some shoes that he had got me. He got me some Jordans about a week ago, 2 weeks ago, but he bought me the Air Force 1s. Let me just show them to you guys. Hold on. But first, also with Zoom, you can never have enough dry erase markers. So he ended up picking up this huge pack because they use these almost every day. And the ones that Zoe had, Z is just like she colors so much with them. And I tell her it's not for paper, it's for a dry erase board. Anyway, does she listen? No, but we got a big pack of them for Zoe School. Okay, I did share this on my Insta stories, but um, I haven't sh shared these with you guys on here. So anyway, here you go. I have not worn them, but I love that print, like a snakeskin print on them. I haven't worn them. I can't wait for spring and summer because I will definitely be rocking these. I love those so much. And I also did share these on my story. Usually I just like share like little clips here and there of what he gets me because I think it's super cute that he goes out of his way to buy me things that I would normally not buy for myself. Um, but these are them. I've worn these once and they were so comfortable. I love those. And you guys, I just saw our email yesterday. He ordered me two more pairs of sneakers that are probably going to be delivered tomorrow. And either I'll share that in this vlog or I'll share it. I never know how this paper goes back in there. Um, or I'll share it in another vlog. But I just thought I would include this because, like I said, my vlog footage has been really short. I also have these stored in the kitchen cabinet because they've already opened like two each of these and these are a really cute valentine's idea because it comes with this like little plastic hammer thing and the heart you smash it super cute and then there's like a little doll in there with like beads it's like so cute the girls love this they don't know that we have two well one each because i'm gonna put this in their valentine's day bucket basket bag whatever i decide to do um, so these are really cute, super cute.